Well, dog days of summer are just about here. Nectar flow is winding down. Sumac is about, oh, uh, should be just about started. And mimosa will be, has already started. So that means we're winding down. And for those of us that have people or actually have them in our own yard, crepe myrtles, the pollen explosion is about to begin. So, I'm just going to give you a little tutorial of what I've done with this hive. It's got a pollen trap bottom board on it. I went through and weakened 10, 10 colonies down here in the yard that needed to be weakened. I put all cat brood in that second deep. She's got the bottom deep laid up. I moved the deep with half deep frames that have honey in it that I was trying to get drawn out from my mating nukes up top. So what I'm doing is I'm going to go in every week, go into any of these colonies when I go through them that are just loaded with a frame of pollen. I'm going to go in and probably since when you when I pull out the bottom board, you're going to see what side they like going in with the pollen. It's this side. So I'll probably put the pollen frame here, but I'll go find a frame with nothing but solid pollen. That way they can continue to raise brood. And I do not have to pull this little tray out to let them bring pollen into the colony. And this is just one day's pollen trappings. I'll take it in, dry it out, get all the little ants out of it, put it in a quart jar, put it in the freezer, and keep it. Because if you keep it in the freezer, it'll last longer. The nutrients will last longer. This is what I pour it into. I'll just pour it into this, set it out. I've heard people baking it in the oven. I don't know why. Just put it in the house. I guess it's get what little bit of moisture in it's out. Well, this time of year, the air conditioning's running wide open. It seems to dry it out because I haven't had any molding issues of pollen. I can see which way they're coming in. So I could probably put a little, I might do that, put a little Vaseline around both, both sides keep them away from it be a little easier because once I set it in the garage it'll have to sit there for a day for all the ants to find, try to find their way home and then it'll be ant free but thanks for watching woolly bees like and subscribe you could actually sell this people buy pollen